Hey guys, it's Matt from Aptopia. Today marks week two of our September product announcements. And the one today, it's probably the one I'm most excited about. Today we're announcing Aptopia for Google Chrome. So what that means is you can get Aptopia's performance intelligence on any app or publisher in any market or store directly within Google Chrome. And in this video, I'm going to walk you through a couple of quick examples just so you can see how easy it is. Let's get started. So I pulled open Zynga.com. I've also installed the Aptopia extension. You can see that the Aptopia extension right here is lit up. Uh, its disabled state is gray. So what that means is that if it's gray, we can't find any information on that app or publisher. If it's lit up, that means we found a match. So obviously we found a match for Zynga. I'm gonna click it. And here we can see uh, Zynga. We found 75 apps in the Google Play Store worldwide for the past 30 days. This link is to the detailed publisher profile that's available in Aptopia. We have a lot of other data points so that kind of gets you there. And then we provide uh, estimates for kind of key performance indicators. So how much revenue are they making? How many downloads? How many MAUs? How many DAUs? But let's take this a step further and let's actually look at an app. So uh, I'm a big fan of Words with Friends. Uh, I usually get my butt kicked, my family crushes me, but let's use that as our example. So I'm going to do Words with Friends iTunes, I'm going to click that, awesome. So again, the extension lit up, so I'm going to go ahead and click that, and we can see that we're looking at Words with Friends, Word Game from Zynga, iTunes, worldwide, past 30 days. Uh, this is a link to the detailed app profile in Aptopia. Um, you know, we have a lot of other data points, everything from ad intelligence to usage, uh, retention, uh, SDK tracking, pretty much everything under the sun we have and that's your way to get there. And then we provide some performance estimates so we can tell you uh, how much revenue they've made in the last 30 days on this particular app, downloads, MAUs, DAUs, their rank in free, the rank overall if it's a paid, paid app, and then their rank overall in terms of grossing. Uh, you also have the ability to toggle to a publisher listing if you wanted to actually look at the publisher revenue uh, or kind of the publisher picture of it. So let's actually take the same example and let's look at Google Play. Okay, I'm gonna pull that open. There's words with friends in Google Play. Cool, and we found a match. So again, we're looking at Google Play now uh, in the last 30 days worldwide. Uh, and these are the estimates for that app in that store. Now let's say we actually wanted to break this down a little bit. So we could go, let's say we want to look US. So we can actually flip this by market very, very easily. Um, and again, this is the link to get the full performance estimates and all the other cool data that we have on this app uh, in Aptopia. But we didn't stop there. We actually took it one step further. So uh, if you're a salesperson, a lot of the time when you're doing research, you're prospecting through LinkedIn. Um, Aptopia for Chrome works with LinkedIn. So we're looking at the Zynga company page. You can see that this is lit up and all you have to do is click it. And you're gonna get the same performance information that you'd find if you were browsing the company website or looking directly within Aptopia itself. Um, couple quick notes for you guys. So one, you may have noticed that our data is in ranges here. Uh, the reason it's in ranges is this gives us the ability to give it away for free. If you are a paying customer, you should get precise estimates upon logging into your Aptopia account. Uh, if not, just contact your contact your customer success manager uh, or email success at aptopia.com. Um, another note, this is an open beta, right? And we need your feedback to one, add new features, but also just to make the app the best that it could possibly be. So uh, if you have any feedback, please join our Slack channel. There should be a link in the blog post as well as the comments for this video. Um, and also just be candid in your feedback. Tell us what's good. Tell us what's bad. Tell us what would make this even better. Um, that's all for now. Thank you guys for watching this quick video. And don't be afraid to give a shout out if you have any questions.